tiro yun. Kaya swerte talaga. Okay, pero mabuti na meron kang presence of mind na bumagsak sa yung bola tapos yeah. naisip mo talaga ang ibus luna yun. Kaya buti na ilabas namin ngayon dito sa last game na three points namin. Okay. Omar, napakaganda ng pinakita mo pero alam ko magpapahinga ka, kailangan mo magpagaling. Bago kita pakawalan, meron kang gustong batiin? Marami, binabati ko yung chewing ko sa Basilan, si Tio Bonjin, pati mga barkada ko dito nanonood, pati mga kamag-ala ko sa bahay, mga kapit-bahay sa Dakota. Okay, maraming salamat, congratulations. Thank you. Okay, pagaling ka, Omar. Ayan po ang ating Mile Energy Athlete of the Game, si Alin Ilagan. At yung nakapagbuslo po ng winning shot, yung interview natin with Omar Asmad. Nakita nyo naman, walang itula. Kabigin po ang ating first game, PCU Dolphins against San Beda Red Lions. And with this, tatapusin na po namin ang first game. Pero dyan lang po kayo dahil meron pa po kaming second game para sa inyong lahat. Tonight is Thursday night, NCAA. Well, Zarate and Ryan Gregorio, ako naman po si Janelle So saying thank you for joining us, NCAA. Ako po si Janelle So for Vintage Television, inviting everyone to stick around for our second salvo for tonight, Thursday night, NCAA night. Our second game, magtatapat po ang JRC Heavy Bombers kalaban ng San Sebastian Stags. Battle for leadership po ang mangyayari ngayong gabi dahil at the end of the first round, Robin, ay tayo po sila pareho sa first spot. And going into the second round, Robin, magkakaalaman na po kung sino sa dalawang team na ito ang mag-lead. Pero hindi po mahirap gawin yan dahil bawat isang team ay anchored or will be anchored by their key players at magagaling po talaga yung mga players nila. Isa na po dito ang nakakapuwing na point guard ng San Sebastian Stags. Walang iba kundi si Christian Coronel, ang ating batang NC. Pero sige, asenso ka na ngayon. Sophomore player ka na. Sige nga, ikaw na pa ang maglilid sa team mo to this victory against their, yung kalaban nyo na makakalaban nyo ngayon against the JRC Heavy Bombers. Malalaman po natin yan. Kung sisimula na po natin ang game, punta na po tayo sa ating panel, Randy Sagdalan and Paolo Trillo. Well, sisimula talaga natin yan dyan. Yung laro dito sa Ninoy Aquino uh, Sports Stadium at uh, maraming na... Marami nagbabantay nito simula pa po nung isang linggo dahil alam nila itong pagbabanggang ito ay eh parang kanta po yan, saving the best for the last. Ayun, Ayun nga yun, Paolo. Ayun, and uh, may hangover pa tayo after that first mm -hmm, game. Yes. Napaka-exciting yung nangyari doon. Pero this is the game to watch dahil nga, fight for first magandang gabi. Mga kaibigan, and uh, alam nyo, miss na miss na ako nitong partner ko. Matagal uh, na hindi kami nagsasama nito. Eh. May mga tatlong linggo na kami hindi nakakapagtabi ni Paolo kaya tatagal rin namin kayo dahil tignan po natin ang pagtatabi ng JRC at saka nitong San Sebastian sa ating pong team standings. Ayan po silang dalawa, Paolo. Kita Tignan naman, nasa tuktok. Tignan naman naman, tikitan talaga yung laban dito. Pero San Sebastian College and Jose Rizal are on top with 4-2 slates. Yung mananalo dito, solo first dyan. Yung matatalo, well, they'll fall into a three-way tie for second place. Yes, with the CSB UPHR at uh, exciting result po. Ang nakita natin kanina, nanalo po ang uh, kuponan po ng PCU. La buzzer beater mula kay Asmad over San Beda. At dito, inaasahan natin ang laban ng JRC Paolo, D. Kitan at saka ng San Sebastian. Talk about uh, JRC. Alam mo, dumayo pa ang mga mag-aaral po ng JRC mula sa Mandaluyong para panoorin itong isa sa kanilang mga key players, si Wendell De La Rea, Paolo. Ayun, ito si Wendell De La Rea. No? He's been a hot man dito para sa JRC Heavy Bombers. You can see yung pagmamature niya dito. Pero tignan mo, yung 15 points a game and 4 rebounds, talagang nakakatulong yan sa JRC. But more than that, very explosive player to si Rendell De La Rea. He likes running the break. Mahilig rin to tumira sa labas. Nung last uh, Thursday, bumira ata ito ng mga malapit na sa 30 mga puntos. So you know this guy can explode at any given night. Yung maganda dito kay Rendell De La Rea, he plays on both ends of the court. Hindi lang sa offensa, pati sa depensa. And so much to say about uh, Wendell De La Rea and the rest of the heavy bombers. Talaga pong bumigat na sila through the years. Samantalang sa kabilang kampo, Talala mo ba nung huli natin kinover ng San Sebastian? Si Jerome Barbosa yung best player natin eh. Siyempre, so, si Jerome, ba Jerome Barbosa, ilang beses na natin na uh, binanggit na team leader of San Sebastian College. You can see yung kanyang points, hindi, hindi masyado malaki dahil maraming score sa San Sebastian. Pero tignan mo yung kanyang rebounding. Mm -hmm. Nine rebounds sa ball game, one of the top rebounders dito sa ating liga. And more than that, yung kanyang intimidation factor sa loob. No? Ito, malaking uh, tao ito si Jerome Barbosa tuwing papasok yung mga players dyan, binubunggo niya to, and he adds yung mga ibang intangibles na hindi natin nakikita sa statistics. Well, of course, pound for pound, pound po dito sa NCAA, si Jerome Barbosa na ata ang pinakamatigas dyan, Paolo. At uh, napapansin niyo yung mga damit namin ni Paolo, eh, medyo kumisig po kami ang bahagya. Ikaw, si Paolo, alam mo, makisig talaga yan. Ako, bahagya lang. Mukhang binata na ngayon <laughs> si uh, the professor. Uh, of course, atit po yan ng uh, Wrangler, the official outfitter of the NCAA. At uh, the kung nakita niyo malalakas ang aming mga katawan katulad nila ubinom din po kami ng Milo the official energy drink of the 7th season of the NCAA mukhang uh, naiinip na sila para panoorin Paolo itong game ng JRC at saka San Sebastian 
Kaya samahan niyo kami dalawa ni Paolo. Manonood po tayo ng laban ng JRC. At kaya wag po kayong aalis. Dito lang po kayo sa VTV. Coverage ng VTV ng 7th season ng NCAA. At dito po sa Pagin Stadium. Paolo, eto labanan para sa pinakamagaling sa unang round ng NCAA ngayong taong 1999. Tama ka dyan, Randy. Ang maganda pa dito sa dalawang teams na ito, sila ang pinaka-consistent mm -hmm. dito sa ating uh, first round ng NCAA. Kaya tignan natin no? pa kung paano sila mag-match up dito. Pero expect a fast at uh, mabilis na wild and wooly na laro ito. Sigurado yan. Uh, sigurado po. po, po. At dito pa lang po sa unang uh, talon. Nakuha po nito uh, San Sebastian. Itong San Sebastian Paolo. Sinalo sila ng uh, San Bed, na Letran sa opening day. And then San Bed. Uh, and at Jose Rizal. Sinalo naman yan ng uh, St. William. Uh, at saka ng uh, Mapua. These four teams are erratically performing in this NCAA. Uh. Uh -huh. So... Uh, Either of the two teams could have pulled away uh -huh. dito sa first round. Pero ganyan talaga yung mga laro natin sa NCAA. At natong Jose Rizal off to a quick start dito. Two points on the board. And if you go by the day's results, eh, parang uh, pantay lang kasi sila. Eh. Earlier, nanalo po ang uh, Mapua sa Letran. And then, nanalo naman ang PCU sa San Beda. At dito, may bibigay din sa dalawang ito. Nagkatapunan ng bola and Melia thought he had uh, Medina's number, pero hindi pa babalik ang uh, possession sa San Sebastian. Well, San Sebastian, starting out with Binoya sa kanilang uh, unang lima. At, uh, teka, binago na rin. <laughs> uh -oh. Akala ko na hindi ko kanina Tuma pa. Tumapakrata to si uh, Medina on the uh -huh. baseline. Kita yeah. natin yung first game results. Nako, what a cliffhanger PCU, no? With that last second shot from Asmad pulling up by two points. What a game. And uh, so far, we've seen... Wala ko kasi nangangang doon. Kahit walang coverage na vintage. Eh. Dikit ang mga laro. And we expect no less ito sa bakbakan po ng JRC at San Sebastian. So kayong mga... Mga nag-aral sa PCU, sa JRC, dito sa San Sebastian. Kaya manunood ka kahit yung akunan nyo hindi naglalaro yun. Eh. Coronelis! Block! At tubaba pa, double block ay and uh, sino yung nakapalpal? Si Ariel uh, Kapos. Oh. Yung pinag-usapan natin ito si Kapos, one of the best all-around performers para dito sa Jose Rizal. Tignan mo, kanyang shot blocking ability. At uh, yan, anticipate niyo yung saksak doon ni Coronel. Still 2 to nothing para po sa heavy bombers. Ito sa unang dalawang minuto ng uh, laro. Arman, giving it to De La Rea. His confidence has really grown. Height. Dito po sa unang round, oh. hindi natin nakita kung si Delaray ang gano'ng kakumpiyansang tumapin sa lapas. Anong talang Medina, oh, oh. magical shot. There's Barbosa, tingnan natin. Panabit ang ginamit itong si Barbosa. At ito yung napapansin na natin ng mga commentators dito sa VTV. Yung mga pinipeature natin bago ng laro. Usually, maganda yung performance nila sa laro na yan. So we see right, right away ito si uh, Barbosa getting involved in the action. Naka-rebound siya ito with a follow-up. Si Barbosa yung average sa Paolo, no? almost double-double for him, 9 points and 9 rebounds per ball game. And Barbosa, what a future for this young man. Uh, of course, game by Cristobal, eh, hinahasa niyang parang jamante yan si Barbosa. Eh. Oh, galing uh, high school pa ito ng uh, San Sebastian College, dire-diretso yan, no? pumasok siya. But uh, freshman year niya dito sa San Sebastian, kasama na niya yung mga star-studded cast ng dati, no? Baste. Yes, at uh, alam mo, magandang tingnan dito sa NCAA, nakikita mo yung continuity ng development ng mga players nila. Eh. From the juniors playing for their modern school, ha? Tama. JRC, who all is this count, the count. Kapus taking Barbosa. I like this matchup. Going Kapus' way. That's a beautiful matchup between Kapus and Barbosa. That time, si Ariel Kapus got the better of uh, Jerome. No? Maganda yung kanyang fake. At uh, si Barbosa kumagat. You know, I wonder at the efficiency of this JRC team. No? Yung mga nakamang kong laro dito. Lalo na yung cliffhanger against uh, San Beta. Tignan mo yung sindot na yan. Clean. Arman has it. He'll stop it in. Yes. To the delight of the mga Jose Rizal fans dito. Napakarami pong mga fans na pumunta rito sa Ninoy Aquino Stadium. 6-2, JRC on top. Uh, kilig na kilig po ang mga mag-aaral ng JRC. Dito po sa loob ng Nino Aquino Sports Stadium, Barbosa to try to power using his shoulder. Sublime, but he gets the ball back. Iisa pa ba? 
Sigi pa rin, wala, diretsyo ang ating bakbakan dito, Paolo, and if Andulan has it for JRC, grabe yung interior defense ng yellow shirt sa loob. Mahirap bantay nito si Barbosa, pero maganda kasi yung double teaming effort sa ilalim. But they were not at all intimidated by the powered shoulders of Barbosa. Takas ka ng kamay nila eh. Uh -huh. They get the ball back, at ito yung uh, wonder matchup natin, Capos and Barbosa. Traveling, yes, he took steps. Yes, pero maganda dito sa Jose Rizal, no? They're going against the defense of Jerome mm -hmm. Barbosa. Siguro, sinusubukan nila to get him in foul trouble as we see that monster slam by Arman. Yes, si Erickson Arman. May kasamang turo pa yan, ha? Oh. Yeah. Tignan mo yung background fans natin <laughs> dito. Tama ka dun, uh, Randy. Kilig na kilig. Yes, mga taga-JRC. Ano mga appreciate mo sa JRC? They've always said this time and again. Alam mo, galing ng Mandaluyong yan. Babiyahe yung mga yan dito. They take any type of transportation just to get them and cheer their schoolmates. Uh, At ito, Ipundulang, he'll get another cake here for JRC. Picture-perfect home run ang ginawa doon ng JRC. And that's the way they've been playing this whole season. Maganda ang kanilang orchestration sa loob ng court. And so far, Pidiena too. And another error committed here by San Sebastian. Ito na pa. Nakikindutan timeout uh, si Mike Cristobal Paolo. Lamang po ang JRC ng anim na puntos. Pag-uusapan po po ito ng mga Recoletos. Ang laro at of course, ang Milo po ang ating official energy drink ng 75th season ng NCAA. At another foul given up here by uh, San Sebastian. At uh, alam mo, si Makapagal, pinasok na partner uh, para sa kutunan ng uh, San Sebastian in an early time on asked by Mike Cristobal. Well, he's sensing trouble dito para sa kanyang Recoletos. Mabagal yung pagsimula nila dito. Maraming turnover and they look disorganized in the court. Shot taken up by uh, Valenia. Missed it. Bobble there by uh, Dinuya. He recovers. Balik natin ang bola dito kay Barbosa. San Sebastian has only scored two points. Nakakawalan na po ang... Uh, JRC for the six-point advantage po para sa heavy bombers, Alfad. Trying to look for some uh, orientation, some movement. Coronel gives it to Alfad. Alfad, Cooper, the shot, no. Nope. But there's Barbosa. How many rebounds na po nakuha ni Barbosa? Nga, no? okay. This is a familiar sight to watch for dito sa ating ballgame. Makikita mo yan si Jerome Barbosa getting a lot of those rebounds underneath. Only the fourth point for San Sebastian. Ball tapped out by uh, Coronel. So, isa pa itong uh, magandang matchup, Randy. No? Coronel on Valenia. Si Valenia makakamatch up ito kay Coronel dahil mabilis rin itong uh, point guard na ito. So, parang uh, parang kidlat yan pagka uh, kumakasan na yan dito so, sa court natin. Itong si Valenia. So much trouble is posed to the opponents. And look at that shot. At sasabi pa lang natin eh. Ayan, si Valenia. Showtime rin ito, no? This guy. Umi-air ito, matagal yung hang time niyo doon, at uh, he creates well off the dribble. Yes, and you'd love the way the fans are cheering for JRC. Sabi naman yung si John Vito, no? you love JRC. <laughs> Wait, tama naman yun, nag-aaro ka sa eskulahin mo. No? Ay, mahalin mo yan. Anim ang lamang ng JRC, bola ko ng uh, San Sebastian. Alfad to Barbosa. Here's the play of the contact made by Ariel Capos. Yan na yung bread and butter play so far ng uh, San Sebastian Paolo. Uh, kasi yung mga outside attempts nila, hindi masyado gumagana pa rito. They're going to Jerome Barbosa underneath. At least nakakasigurado sila na Barbosa can fish for those fouls or get some two points inside. So Nathan Gregorio came in to replace Ariel Capos. Taken the course against Barbosa. Makapagal. It's a long three-pointer for him. Instant offense here for Makapagal. Kakapasok pa lang po ito. And uh, he, he was able to nail that outside jumper. Kapundulan. It's a tough matchup for him. Capos. Look at the turn of Capos. Hindi naman rotonda po itong si uh, Jerome Barbosa. But the foul was given up on uh, Mercado. Well, good health defense given uh, by Mercado. Kahit naka-foul siya doon, kung wala siya doon, uh, nakaikot na sana ito si Ariel Capos for those two points. The shot by Valenia. And Barbosa, kung hindi mo ang video foul, nakasisigot niya. Protect sa bola eh. Oh. They try to work it inside. The shot for him, nakapagal. Baseline, lost it. They get it back. Alfad, at a corner. 13 and 54 in the first half. San Sebastian is trailing JRC 10 to 6. Magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. Salamat po sa pagsama niyo sa amin ni Paolo Trinidad at si Rani Santalan sa pag-cover po nitong uh, diamond season ng NCAA. JRC at San Sebastian at yung offensive foul at Alpac.
Oh, si Alpad guarding uh, Valenya. The shorter, faster, uh, quicker Valenya. At uh, nahuli siya doon, he warded off. 10 to 6, 4 point lead para po sa kukunan ng JRC. Na host po ngayong taong to ng uh, NCAA. And they want this thing going for them. De La Rea, quick on the attempt, but makapagal. Really a shadow on De La Rea. Alam nila kung ano magagawa natin si uh, Wendell De La Rea. Coronel, the ship to Mercado. He want it closer. Here is Alfad. Block by Capus. Ito nila na sa leather para sa JRC. Go, go, go. Here's Gregorio. At uh, uh -huh. parang icing na lang para Mabilis sa ito. Mabilis na lang mag-fast break ng JRC. Huwag mo sinang bibigyan ng uh, pagkakataon na gumanyan sa fast break. Si si Rendell Delaya quick with the release. Yes, Delaya. Aba. We've seen him grow dito po sa NCAA. Oh, difficult pass. Very tight. And again, the Bombers are running. And Valenya walking the power for the guy. This is when Jose Rizal College is most dangerous no, on the fast break. Talagang uh, ayan yung laro nila. And they're lethal. Pagdating dito sa mga fast break points. At may depensa nito na JRC. Ha? Not a very good shot selection for San Sebastian. Forcing them to go to their bread and butter play almost all the time. Ito, buta mo kay Barbosa. Time it. But there's Alfad luckily. <laughs> Swerte na lang yun para sa San Sebastian. Uh, eh. Well, wala pa sila dito sa rhythm sa first half so far. Alam natin. Yung uh, San Sebastian is capable of passing that ball around and have coming up with good plays. Pero so far, hindi pa natin nakikita yan. Making steps is Nathan Gregorio. Itong relievo ng tao ng San Sebastian, alam mo, humahanap ng kombinasyon si Coach Bay Cristobal. We now have Alvin Pua and Falca Santos and Alfad and Coronel goes out. Okay, some new faces on the court now for the Red Shirts. At uh, iibahin talaga dito ni Coach Bay Cristobal yung kombinasyon niya. Ooh. But the fortune staying outside of San Sebastian. Capos So Rendell De La Rea at the middle. Epundulan. Oh, no, but there's Capos Still strong. They still have the ball. Del Epundulan, they want it. Yes. On a grand slam fashion. Maganda dito sa yellow shirts. Lahat ng uh, limang players dyan sa court. Nag-aaway talaga po. Oh, Nang po, lahat pa sila makakuha ng bola. At uh, talagang they're showing a lot of fire coming into this game. Ito mo naman yung ikot na to, ah. They're gonna take it, Epundulan. He'll score here. Nope, not in that instance. But the energy, uh, si Epundulan, actually, ang score niya, ito yung 3 point play in the making natin. Na hindi po ikinasok ni uh, Epundulan. He's got it. A loose ball uh, picked up here for San Sebastian. But like I said, no, on that last replay, makikita natin, no, yung mga yellow shirts are fighting for that ball. At uh, parang mas gusto nilang kunin yan kaysa sa mga red shirts ng San Sebastian. So last year, if we recall, Paolo, JRC went on to a uh, 3 to nothing run in the standings only to taper off later on in the tournament. In this ball game, this is the last game of the first round and they're looking to grab number one uh, spot. Well, it's a different story dito para sa Jose Rizal College pagdating natin dito sa Diamond season ng NCAA. More mature, more seasoned veterans para sa Jose Rizal ngayon. Has three points, 10 to nothing for JRC. And that's what we talked about. Yung uh, San Sebastian has not gotten the rhythm dito sa first half. On the other hand, JRC are running uh, very well dito sa fast breaks. So far, already involved are Epundulan, Capos, and uh, De La Rea. Capos lost that ball. Here is Mark Makapagal, 3 on 1. They have the numbers. And Mercado just lays it in. Ito, no? Kailangan na kailangan niya ng San Sebastian. Their first two points of transition. Uh, that, that should get them going dito sa ating first half. Four point lead for Sir JRC. Capos, Epundulan. Epundulan still searching. Oh, dito kayo, tatik na. Kasi nakaplanta na yung defense rin ng uh, San Sebastian. Uh, got a few seconds to shoot. Valenia, they've got four seconds to shoot. He takes it, and the shot just hit the red. And now Alvin Pua secures the letter for para sa Sebastian training. They are since 16 to 12. And the time, hindi nakapos doon ang uh, JRC. Ito ngayon ang San Sebastian. Let's see what Alvin can do over Ariel Campos. Mercado searching the field to the main man, Jerome Barbosa of San Sebastian. Compostihan na niya at uh, yun na. Ano yung diferensya? And it's a turn of Boy Rivera to ask for a timeline in favor of JRC. All of a sudden, just a two-point lead now for the Heavy Bombers. Just half 
Paolo, this is an interesting play that you want to point out sa ating mga uh, televiewers. Well, tignan mo yung sinabi mga bread and butter play, Jerome Barbosa, ipopost din nila to, no? But look, apat na players ang nakitingin dyan, walang nag-help defense. Kailangan nila mag-double down on Jerome Barbosa. Hindi nila kayang i-one-on-one yan si Barbosa. He will just overpower yung kanyang defenders. And that, that last play, nakakuha siya ng two points. Katalang nakasakit sa JR dito. Eh. Sa gitna siya umikot. Hindi oh. naman sa baseline. Eh. So, apat. Apat yung nakatingin sa kanya ron. Tumingin lang sila kay Jerome Barbosa. At itong JR dito, dalawang puso na naman tibitigan nila. At nawala pa po sa kanila ang bola. And they're really having a difficult time. Naman tala kung kanyang po eh, nagututo. Jollibee gives you big savings. So Jollibee's best sellers, 20% off. That's 20% savings on one piece chicken joy value meal and spaghetti special value meal. This is only until August 29th, so better hurry. Isang limo na lang. Tapos na yung promo yan. Si Valenya! Ho, ho, ho! Huwag naman, pero nakakita ng foul. Two free throws for Valenya. Foul po si Palca Santos, si Roy. And again, itong Jose Rizal nang uuna sa break. Tignan mo, Valenya opting to go all the way. At may body contact tayo dyan on that replay. Si Valenya, na-impress ka rito kay Valenya Paolo, ha? Oh. Sabi mo, alakta ako dyan, eh. <laughs> oh, kanina, katabi kasi natin yan sa court. Medyo maliit siya, no? Pero he makes up for it with yung kanyang uh, quickness. At ito si Valenya, magaling talaga mag-create ito ng uh, opportunity for his teammates. Already five points for Jody. And a bundle of dynamite ito si Jody Valenya. The lead is up to four for JRC. Ito si Sebastian, eh, minsan palang nakaagapay, nakatabla, at hindi pa po nakalamang. Ang uh, San Sebastian dito po sa first half, meron na, pong, meron na lamang po siya mulito sa rebounds. JRC kontra kay Barbosa. Ito, pito sa pito. Barbosa averages 9 rebounds sa ball game Dito sa first half pa lang tayo, wala pa tayo sa 9 minute mark. 7 rebounds na kaagad. Dito para kay Barbosa. Surprisingly, JRC only with 7 boards. And... Having difficulty handling the letter at the baseline itong si Epundulan. Yung nakakapagtaka dito, Randy, uh, JRC only with 7 rebounds. Pero ang dami nilang uh, fast break uh -huh. attacks dahil siguro yung pressure defense nila. Yes. No, marami silang nakukuha mga agaw at uh, yung mga turnovers. So nakakatakbo pa rin sila. So while you saw there the shot of uh, Coach Mike Cristobal of San Sebastian, makapagal. A lot of time for them. Taking it strong and short, and Alvin Tua again, and I think there's an injury against Mark, but Mark Makapagal. In that instance, he was hit. Biglang bumagsak na lang ito. And uh, sigurado tayo na natamahan siya sa mukha. Yes, we'll try to see, and uh, we missed that point. Actually, after the tiram yun eh. Trying to locate him. Well, sa angulo na yun. So, tignan natin dito. Uh, ah. Ito, abang ang gula naman to Paolo. Eh. There's Makapagal. There's the hand of uh, Gregorio that got into the face of uh, Mark Makapagal. And, uh, he will... Mark Makapagal uh, now being replaced. Ito si Medina, papasok para sa kanya. At sayang, no? Pagpasok ni Mark Makapagal, medyo doon-doon nagsimula yung rally ng uh, San Sebastian Stags. He played a good few minutes, no? Nang nasulob siya ng court. Well, contributed two points for San Sebastian. It's a two-point lead for the heavy bombers. Bah, si Pinoyer pinagtapi ng uh, kanyang uh, shirt. JRC on top with two points. Palca Santos making it difficult and a turnover. Mercado. Pinasa pa kay Barbosa. Pinapos tuloy. They missed the opportunity. Balik sa JRC. Capus. Gumitin pa sa ere. And no transition defense for the red shirts. Talagang uh, bibirado talaga dito yung Jose Rizal pagdating sa fast breaks. Ano mo, baliktad. No? Kung gano'ng kahirap sa San Sebastian kung execute sa fast break. Pagbalik sa JRC, ang dali lang eh. Oh. Medina, oh, that's a wily play for Cholo Medina. Alam mo, only a two-point lead here for Jose Rizal. Pero the difference is, yung uh, San Sebastian, naghihirap sila oh. to get those points. They're bleeding for their points. Samantalang dito sa Jose Rizal, napakadali ng mga points sila on the fast breaks. And a turnover here by Jose Rizal. Here is Barbosa. Bring down the leather. Mercado. Tamo, hindi pa na ibigay ng mahusang. Media wouldn't give him the shot. And Mercado would have to earn it at the 4.5 meter line. Well, that's a smart play for Milia. 4 on 2 fast break opportunity yan para sa red shirts. Eh. Eh, ayaw niya bigyan ng dalawang puntos. Earn it from the line na lang daw, sabi niya. 
of Rendell de Rea coming back to the fold para sa Jose Rizal. But, uh, si Mercado, Bernie Mercado. Oh. Hindi kasanayan pa ata itong si Bernie Mercado. At kasantaan na pala itong si Bernie. Oh. Eh? Actually, rookie ito si Mercado. Pero nakita natin sa last few games niya, maganda, matigas yung uh, player na ito. He's a very solid player that at uh, magaling rin dumipensa ito si Mercado. Si Rafli, kumbinasyon nila ni Binoya pag sumasabay silang dalawa sa loob. Alam mo, nandiyan na yung uh, mabigat na tandem nito nga si Mercado at si Binoya. But this time, it's Mercado. Mula sa mga 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 Lagi tayo tumatay ng gano'n sa pakate. Uh, lagi rin traffic <laughs> sa mga <mesa> taan. <laughs> Pero, no, mga tao dyan, 24 hours, gising din. And, good evening, mga kaibigan po namin sa taan ni Paolo. Sa taan ng Mahinjira. Dela Rea. It's not good work. So far, not even for Chapo Rendell. Sholo Medina was fouled from behind by Efon Dulan. Ito yung sinasabi natin. Yung uh, San Sebastian trying to run. Pero hirap rin sa namakuha ng uh, punto sa fast breaks. Yung uh, Jose Rizal has been challenging yung kanilang mga fast break attacks. Alfad back in harness. At itong si Medina. Ito pa lang si Medina. Kalaro doon ni Kaloy Garcia sa Isabela ng bata sila. Eh. Matapot sila si Medina. Of course. Alam ko si Kaloy, taga Ilaga ni Isabela yan. Uh, uh, marami tayo kaibigan. Hindi lang ang parunong mag Ilocano. Eh. Parang naimbag ng malin na ata sa inyuntanan. Whatever, no? Basta good evening po mula sa amin ni Paolo. Pero si Medina, eh, sa mga Inila, o, oh, kamong ilaga ni Sabela. Ayan, ilaga uh, ni Sabela. And si Medina, senior na ito para sa San Sebastian. He picked up maraming nakuwang uh, experience ito nung naglaro ito sa PBL. At ngayon, isa na sa mga leading scores ng San Sebastian. Kinulia, short stab. Oh, yes, it looks great. On this side, not even Alvin Pulo could stop that shot from Kinulia. One point lead for JRC. Here is Mercado against Epundulan, the rookie versus the veteran. But to try to stretch the defense here of uh, JRC with the incursion of Medina to fall away, nothing going for him. And this time without Barbosa, no offensive boards. And Epundulan is hacked by Bernie Mercado. And Mercado trying to go for the ball. Pero ito, no, nakuha niya yung kamay ni... Si Mundulan. Mundulan, oh. At that was a hard foul given up. Pero ito, no, bumabawi ngayon yung San Sebastian. Ay nilabigyan ng easy two points ang Jose Rizal. Oh, despite the run and gun play of this Jose Rizal. It's a one point, two point difference separating Jose Rizal. Now it's a two point lead. At somehow, kung ikaw si Bay Cristobal, masamayin na rin natin. Pero isa dalawa lang yung nilalaman sa amin nila Boy Dibere. Oo. Oh. Pero maganda yung uh, pag-aano ni pag-coach ngayon dito ni Coach De Vera dito sa season. Oh. Kita-kita mo, ang ganda ng sistema dito ng Jose Rizal. May game plan talaga itong mga to. And they've grown with uh, Coach De Vera through the years. His fourth year, itong mga player na to, palagay ito, ikaapat na taong din nila sa EJRC. Uh, uh, so, alam mo, lumaki silang magkasabay. Mercado, magical shot. Now the shots, De La Rea, Lilia is open. He'll take it. Yes, he'll score. And look at the ball movement being displayed here by JRC. Maganda talaga yung pag-igot nila ng bola. Unselfish play dito para sa mga yellow shirts. And quickly as we watch this ball game, six minutes na lamang po ang... Uh...